So what happens when integration by parts goes wrong? Well, the reason why it goes wrong is if you don't use the late law, okay? where you don't know in which order to pick you. So let's say we made the wrong choice. Let's say we selected u to be e to the x and dv by dx to be equal to x. So I would differentiate d, uh, u, so du by dx is equal to e to the x. dv by dx, I need to integrate to get to v, so that's one half x squared. And so I would have u times v, so one half x squared e to the x, take away the integral of v times du by dx, so one half x squared e to the x dx. Now the problem here is that I then need to integrate one half x squared e to the x, for which I would need to use integration by parts, and what's going to happen is that I would then get another integral with an x cubed e to the x, and then I'd get an x to the 4 e to the x, and the problem will go on and on and on and on forever if I keep picking the wrong u. So subsequently, this just keeps on going on and on and on and on, and you should, at this point, be looking at your question and your, well, what you've done with your answer so far, and just saying, well, I can't go any further. And so, go back, then select x to be u instead, and dv by dx to be e to the x, and try it again. Okay? So, that's what can happen when integration by parts goes wrong. It can go on and on and on forever, and get harder and harder and harder because of it.